How's it going guys? I'm Oz and welcome back to another episode of Until Dawn. Last episode we did one of those sp spooky like spiritual things that you know Josh was thinking that we're messing with him. Anyway it turns out we're not. Now we're with um these two. Mike and I keep forgetting what her name is. Is it Emily or Emily's the other one? I don't know. Wow. Shit's going down. I don't like it. We haven't even made it to the cabin yet. I just realised we're supposed to be going like this is way too far away. Just to go to a camp cabin. Anything can happen out here. I'm losing my voice as well, which I'm not enjoying. Was, <laughs> was it someone screaming? No, no, uh, probably just a squirrel. <laughs> You're funny, man. Squirrel. Town. How many chapters are there in this bloody game? A bit. Ah. What? Do you hear that? No. I've got control. Hello? Someone there? Oh, no, sometimes it's better not to do anything. Stop watching me, man. Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. This can't be it. Maybe this is like clues. No. This guy's gonna go through a pretty hard time. I don't wanna have to scare them any more than what I have to. Hey. Check out this mask. Oh, why? It's so weird, right? It creeps me out. I think you like it. Oh my god. Oh, Mike, stop! Huh? You're lost. This guy's got no clue. Is there anything else in there that's interesting? Status update. Okay, nothing else. Right. We're still not there yet. This is like the fucking longest hike to a cabin ever. I was just expecting it to be, you know, like 100 meters down the way. These camera pans in the wilderness are really good. <laughs> what is that? I'm not sure I want to know. Needles don't do that. It's horrible. Gee, I don't think he's gonna make it. Hey, bud. Oh hey, buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. It's okay. Oh. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Oh, 
Oh, I feel tough. Stay on the path, we're almost there. Oh god. Go down. What the fuck? No, no, no. That yeah. was not a bear. Yeah. Things are crazy fast. And I didn't see it. Hey, things are not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. I was gonna say the same thing. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay, I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh, typical. Brr. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Oh, wow, you're high maintenance. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice, cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Seriously, right. after it, what just happened to us, you... Once we're rubbing up against each other. My yeah. fire and mood lighting. Yes, my lady. How about you help, you bitch? Ah, this will take care of the mood lighting. Ooh, what's this here? Shiny. Winning bronze. What's this? Unless you want to make out with an ice sculpture, I suggest you get a fire going. Pronto. Is there seriously nothing in the bathroom? Oh, hang on. Shit. What do you think was in there, Mike? Come on. Yeah, I thought that might have happened. Why isn't the Kama Sutra? Are you serious? Oh, hell yeah. These guys were inventive. Whoa. Oh, that's I'm not so sure good. if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. Wow. Is that really in this cabin? So, what is with the, all these clues and stuff that we're getting? Oh, everything keeps changing. Why You're lighting a fire, Michael, not writing a novel. How much longer is it going to take you? Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. 
Ah! Hey, Fly, are you okay? What are you doing? It's, it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. But it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. <laughs> um, I can't fix that now. So, what do I do? Mike! What? Oh, crap! What? what? Where is it? What? What? What's wrong? Gone! Not it your mobile, gone. I hope. But I think... slow down. What is gone? My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? Crap! No! I must have dropped it outside. Oh. Yeah. Does I it can't really lose matter? my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll have you look for it. It's got to be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear. Yeah. Or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. Looky, looky. Who's going to fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? There's gonna be more than one clue in this place. What's this? Oh, yes. yes. Look at this. Is it a fire? No, way cooler. I'm gonna scare. I probably shoot it by accident. Huh? How do you like me now? Oh my god. Why do guns make them go completely bonkers? Nothing. I'm watching the windows, man. Right. I shall never understand what we have together. But there was something else there, well, there wasn't it? What's this here? Looks like we weren't the only used. ones to meet the friendly neighborhood terror bears. Native American that hunters does not use. make me feel any better. Use symbols and signs scratched onto trees to dubbed onto walls to communicate with other tribe members. Many symbols conveyed religious or mythical beliefs. Others warned of danger or offered protection and some told of good hunting grounds. Most symbols were specific to the tribe that used it. Shown below is the opposite and shown below and Opposite are some symbols used by North America and Canada. A ward or spell protecting against evil spirits. A vision or dream of the future. Hang on. I wonder if I can read that in the actual menu. Oh, that's the uh, mask. An old mining mask. The name inside says it belongs to Billy Bates. Oh, okay. According to the book on the cabin, the symbols are to ward off evil spirits. Sam looked at Chris's incoming message. Sam was offered, was offended by Sam's indiscretion. Oh, these are the butterfly effects. Hmm. Okay. Well. Oh, come on. These controls are a little clunky. having to do this. Oh yeah, it's just gonna Man start. One. Oh Fire. very nice. Bravo. Alright, my lady. 
what comes next? <laughs> I think... Well, I, I wish we had some booze. Seriously? Uh, well, uh, if I'd have known that ahead of time. I don't know, I'm, I'm kind of just I'm not feeling it yet. Am I doing something wrong? No, 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 no. I mean, I thought you were one way, but you're kind of another way. Does if that make sense? It's, it's not your fault. Uh, Jess, I really like you. Whoever you think I am, well, just give me a chance, and I will show you what you need. Oh, my God. Well, I am liking your confidence. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please? Can't you do something yourself? There's just no one out there. I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is. Don't like it. Happy Voila. Night. Shutters are shut it. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I think. I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up, and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm really kind of insecure. Sorry. I like how they look towards the thing you that you're picking. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh, <laughs> you have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. Mm. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah, I guess I do. Yeah, and that's super fucking hot. Really? Oh my god. Yes. Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you too. I am definitely ready to be handled. Get on with it, whatever you hell you are. Oh. Get your clothes back on. Mike? What is that? I don't know. Okay, well, go find out now, please. It's your phone! What? How is it my phone? I don't know, it just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake, god damn it! What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. <sighs> this is a massive ass. Oh no! 
Hey! Yeah, bricks! That means you! I know! <laughs> Okay, coming so up, then we have sex. Because I'm now we're going to. they were if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. I really need to pee. Josh looked really freaked out at the seance. Yeah, I mean, he, he looked like he was keeping it together, but... Do you think we shouldn't have mentioned his sisters? I mean, it's why we came back up here. Yeah, but not to, like... Have a seance. Maybe we went too far. <sighs> Damn it. I don't know why people think this game's fun. Like, how do people get through the games like this? How do you? How do you? How do you... <laughs> Holy crap! Are you okay? I think so. Oh God, it's pain. Look. What? There was something behind the box. Like, how do you what shut it that? off? I can't it shut button? it off. Why would there be a button? That's a good question. Should I push it? That's what buttons were for, I guess. Push it. Push it real good. <sighs> oh, panel opens. Head explodes. Are we, like, in a movie right now? If we a are, video game, technically. Leave it to the Washingtons to have secret passages in their house? I mean, maybe they didn't even know. This place is super old. So... Should we take a look? Yeah, after you. No, 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 no. You go. Gee, thanks. Um, let's have a look around the room first and see if there's anything here. Nothing shiny? Okay. Well, fuck. Ah. Oh. What did you find? Holy cow. Now, now Ash, I, I, I don't want to freak you out, but, but look at this. What? Chris, what is that? I... I think this might be what the spirit board wanted us to find. The clue? Yeah, it's a letter. Let me see it. It's a, a threat. Chris, this is serious. We need to find Josh right now. <laughs> I hate spiders. I hate, I really hate spiders. Uh, what was that? We're supposed to go that way, aren't we? Do you think someone was actually after Hannah and Beth? If so, that would be really messed up. This one's good to know the tribe felt still feel an attachment to the land, even though it's a few unfortunate problems. Graffiti people sleeping in the outbuildings I have made contact with the descendants of the tribe and intend to make a donation to the elder council. Healing wounds of the past won't be easy, but it's a step that's necessary. 
Looks like it was written by Josh's mom. Yeah, she's really making an effort to set things right with some native tribe or something. Yep, the bad karma goes back a long way. Well, I haven't looked at this one yet. There's no way I fucking hear all going outside. You fuck that off. So, um, I've just been thinking about something I saw earlier with Sam. What? It, there was like this wanted poster, like full on Western style, you know? So? And Sam really thought there was someone following her around. So, so what you're saying, there's some criminal up on the mountain with us? And then I found that crazy psycho letter. Chris, if this is your way of trying to make me feel better, you're fired. <laughs> you hear that? That was Josh! Coming from the kitchen. <laughs> Josh! Josh! Oh. Coming! Hold on! I'm going to show you some uh, pictures of people that you have come to know. But maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. Well, this is an exercise in honesty. Tell me which person from each pair you like the most. Take your time. Your answers are important. Oh, that's a really tough one because I like both of them. Sam. Definitely Matt. God, I hope I'm not giving these guys a death sentence. Ah, oh, that's tough. Chris scared me. I didn't like that. Definitely Mike. You know, it's just a bitch. Why are you looking at me like that? Josh. And then Chris. Calling me a liar. Tell me, 
in this little game you're playing so diligently, who is it that you most dislike? Emily. A bit too bitchy for you to taste. How did you guess? Often the lack of confidence manifests itself as overconfidence. Think about that. Is that not just a little bit like? Seriously, again? Oh. So quickly? Once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. We'll talk again soon. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. Apparently, he had warned them against pursuing their construction project in Blackwood Pines and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. S. I. S. T. Sister? Ask it whose sister? Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Which sister is it then? Ah! Run! Ah! Oh. oh my god. Yes. So what happened to Josh in there? Come here. Maybe I know how to handle you too. Ah! 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 Oh fuck! Oh fuck, what the fuck? Jessica! Oh my god! Oh my god! Jess! Jess! Oh yeah, fuck this. If we're gonna continue any further, I need to go to the toilet. So, like, favorite, and subscribe. I really hope you enjoyed the episode. Oh my god. And I'll see you again soon. Thanks, guys. Bye! <gasps> Chris! Are you there? Hello, and thank you all for joining me. Tonight, we're going to conduct a little experiment, sort of test. Now for this experiment, we'll need the cooperation of our two test subjects, Joshua and Ashley. But we're going to need one more brave participant to help decide which subject will live and which will die. Please, 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 everyone calm down. It's all very simple. Christopher, you will find a lever placed directly in front of you. All you have to do is choose who you will save.